in the winter time, we get ashy. We do. It is really, really, really important, especially in the winter time. and welcome back to living life with your favorite nurse so if you're new to my channel we are all about health and wellness lifestyle and beauty and a little bit of nursing so don't forget to subscribe and join the family and to my returning subscribers welcome back so if I had to choose my least favorite season it would honestly be winter it is gloomy it is dark and it is cold and it sucks especially with the lockdown I feel even more trapped um, this winter than I typically do and that's really really unfortunate so your mental health honestly takes a huge toll in the winter so that's why today I decided to share with you guys my five winter wellness tips to get you through winter time so let's get started so my first tip maintain a healthy diet so in the winter time we tend to reach for a lot more junk we are looking for our comfort food and I I am someone that does that a lot we all maybe not all but a lot of us tend to get a lot heavier over the winter time so honestly after winter sometimes we're a little bit more sluggish even during winter we're a little bit more sluggish and slow and we add a little bit of pound so it's important to actually maintain a healthy diet through winter time you can treat yourself but you definitely want to give yourself more healthy options than not so honestly it's really really important to maintain a healthy diet through winter honestly through the entire year but definitely through winter it's honestly great to treat yourself it's great to enjoy but you have to definitely do it in moderation if you're craving sweets you know maybe reach for an apple opposed to you know your cookies and your candy and stuff like that again you can have those things sometimes but more than not reach for a healthier snack so like bananas apples grapes you know, not all the fruits are in season in the winter, but definitely take a look to see what's in season and what you like. So with the lack of sun during the winter time, we're also not getting all the vitamin D that we need. So definitely take a look online to see, you know, what foods contain a lot of vitamin D that you actually do like. Don't force yourself to have anything you actually don't like, but definitely eat more of the things with vitamin D that you do like and add them into your diet. So my second tip, battling the winter itch. So one thing that happens to my skin in the winter is that it becomes crazy crazy dry and that's honestly one of the things that I dread all year. So in the winter time a lot of our skins become dry and scaly and itchy and that's where the winter itch came from and is the worst. In the winter time, well all year but especially in the winter time, you need to use your moisturizers, you need to use your serums so if you haven't watched my um, winter skincare routine, definitely go take a look at it it is really 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 important especially in the winter time so it's also not just about your face it's also about your body in the winter time we get ashy we do so lather your cocoa butter lather your vaseline that is really really important especially right after you get out of the shower you don't want your skin to dry up that is the best time and the first thing that you need to do after you get out of the shower also avoid using you know scolding water i love my hot water but that is also another thing that really really dries out your skin so my third tip hydrate so just because it is not blazing hot does not mean that you don't need to drink water and does not mean that you should not be hydrated people actually tend to drink a lot less water in the winter but honestly just as any other season you should be drinking just as much water as you typically do in the summer or even more so signs of dehydration or that you're not getting enough water is fatigue being tired all the time dry and scaly skin and you know just not feeling great so definitely get your eight cups of water and don't just drink one cup of water a day definitely hydrate yourself it's so important for how you feel and it's also important for your skin as well so sometimes honestly sometimes just having uncomfortable skin can just turn you off just make you feel down just make you feel gloomy so it's important that you take care of your skin in the winter time so tip number four is keep yourself busy and just try to be active some way somehow so in the winter time it gets really cold it also gets 
dark faster so everywhere is just gloomy it's just it's just not fun so a lot of us get the winter blues when you kind of just don't want to do anything you don't want to talk to anyone you kind of just want to be by yourself and you're just you're just in a funk and sometimes that can last all winter so some things that you can do is really try to stick to your hobbies find things that you know you like to do find things that you know you miss doing or that you want to try this is a really great opportunity especially with lockdown if you know there's nowhere to go take up a new task take up a new hobby that you've always wanted to try that you could do at home that will kind of you know give you something to look forward to also, it's important that you know you talk to your friends, talk to your family as well, and just try not to be alone. Um, try not to be stuck in your head or you know stuck in a funk. Try to talk to people that you know that you care about and that you miss and things like that. And hopefully, you know they can also help you get through the winter blues, and you can also help them get through the winter blues as well. So on that note, my fifth tip is me time. So I know I said stay connected and things like that to people as you should but sometimes honestly you just need a little bit of me time as well sometimes you know you just want to have a little spa day by yourself a self-care day you want to read a book um, you just want to do things by yourself think reflect pray all those type of stuff as well so me time is also really important during the winter time as well you know when it comes summer we're going to be hanging out doing all these things so just have all the thoughts that you want to have as long as they're good thoughts and you know you can keep yourself company as well sometimes all people need is just a good hour of me time and they're good to go so definitely put that into your routine so definitely take time for yourself as well and you know do things that make you happy as well all right guys so those are my five winter wellness tips to get you through winter i hope you enjoyed them let me know what you're doing through winter you know to kind of just get yourself together and just to make it through i hope you guys have a wonderful and blessed week i will see you guys next week and keep living life from your favorite nurse